Hello, we're London Type Foundry. My name's Paul Harpin. I work with a guy called Paul Hickson, who I commissioned type for for many years. So I'm a newcomer to type design, and uh, we work with Joe Graham, who looks after the uh, tech side and all the commercial part of what we do. Um, I designed a typeface um, to raise money for cancer research in Macmillan, because my niece sadly died, and it's called the Buy Font Save Life campaign. And uh, Paul and Joe very kindly helped me with that. And, I kept designing more type and they approached me amazingly to see if I wanted to start this new venture called the London Type Foundry. You can see you've got a great variety of typefaces over the last four years, so we're a fairly new business. Paul's a grandmaster, he, he can really design any kind of type. Um, he just simply loves drawing letters. He works with his uh, wife Pat occasionally on projects. Um, we both have ideas and Paul helps me finish off and uh, we really are a, a very, very working closely, toing and froing constantly with projects. Um, very pleased about how it's gone. Um, so uh, the language of London um, inspires quite a lot of what we do, um, as you can see here. I designed this um, typeface uh, inspired by Hoxton Square, and every character sits within a grid. Uh, my typefaces are a bit like that; they're more ideas-based. And uh, it's got a sister typeface called Golden Square. This as a magazine designer, I liked headlines to align, and that was the whole idea of this family. Um, this one's inspired by my old boss at Banks of Miles, John Miles, post office double line, and also by the Mexico Olympics, which I loved. Um, this is my reaction to Brexit. Also, um, I was very pleased with my London Modern. I finally found it arrived when I did this very refined headline typeface, inspired by magazines from the 60s. We have guest designers like Peter Grundy, the information graphics artist who designed these dingbats. I started doing it. I thought, why don't you use Peter to design these symbols, done that sort of thing his whole life. And also, my friend H.E. Kono, who designed New Johnston for London Transport, has allowed us to sell his typeface London Kono through our foundry. Um, in lockdown, we've been quite busy because I had less general design work. Um, so I've got quite a few new typefaces like London Queenstown and um, so lots of flourishing alternative characters. Um, one inspired by the north and south bank differences of the different sides of the river in London and a very systemised one called Penrose. It's got lots of variations of style inspired by the Penrose family who are mathematicians and artists. And incredibly, Paul and his wife Pat have been doing these initial capital letters for his new typeface, Garamond Royale, that we're about to release. They did it one a day. Pat's a botanical illustrator and in awe of what they can do. Honoured to work with them. Um, we're London Type Foundry. If you like it, please do find us online. We have an Instagram page as well. And I hope you enjoy the typefaces.